Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Zach B. You guys can call me Hazardous and welcome back to my channel and thank you for tuning in. So, David Von Hart tweeted out four things today regarding some absolutely astonishing Call of Duty Black Ops 3 information. He tweeted out, double XP weapons comes on at 10 a.m. plus workarounds for a leaderboard crash, map exploits, and patches. And the one thing you are really going to care about is the work we are doing to normalize assault rifles versus SMGs. I'm going to let it ride over the weekend to be sure it sticks, and if it does, I will post details later on Reddit. Here is the one hint because I will always love you. Rest in peace, Vesper. Rip Vesper. Mostly kidding. Mostly. So, we're going to be getting a lot of things going on in this next update, and I cannot wait to cover the patch notes that comes out after this weekend. So basically, obviously with the double XP weapons that are coming on, or that have already come on today at 10 a.m., and some fixes that are coming up for leaderboard crashes and map exploits, specifically on the new Awakening DLC, it seems like the Vesper is going to get a huge, huge nerf. I don't know. He says, rest in peace, Vesper. Mostly kidding, mostly. I doubt it's going to be unusable after this, but it definitely won't be as good as it was because... You know, that's just what David Von Hart does. People have been cl complaining that this weapon has been overpowered for so long, and finally they are doing something about it. Now that I have Dark Matter, I've been using it a lot more, and I love it. It's so good with, like, long barrel, extended mags, excuse me, and grip, but also it's really good with long barrel, or excuse me, it's really good with silencer, extended mags, and grip, and now I'm going to miss it when it gets patched, but I'm glad that assault rifles will be more of a dominant weapon in this game. In every Call of Duty, for the most part, some machine guns were the dominant class, and now assault rifles may actually have a chance, so I'm very, very happy that that will be the case. I'm very excited to see what's going to happen in this, and if the assault rifles turn out to be a lot better, a lot of the videos that you guys will see will have assault rifles in them now, because I do use a lot of submachine guns, but I love using the assault rifles. The Man of War is amazing. I don't know if they're going to do anything to the M8A7. That weapon is just so messed up beyond all belief. They buff it like eight times and then they nerf it back to how, and now it's worse than it was at release. So I don't even know what the point of that was. They were just like testing out the reaction, but they got that reaction. That's probably why they're going to nerf the Vesper now. So yes, the Vesper is getting nerfed. Some workarounds for a leaderboard crash are going to be fixed and some map ep exploits are going to be patched also. And that's basically what he's going to do. I will report back when the patch notes get thrown up on Reddit and also on other Intel sources like Charlie Intel and stuff. So definitely stay tuned. Stay tuned for more videos coming out today. I want to thank you for watching. Let's see if we get a 10 likes this video. Rip. Rest in peace, Vesper. But with that being said, I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe if you guys are new for more Call of Duty videos. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Adios, amigos.